Right, so this is going to be a video covering the new Raspberry Pi. This is the Model B Plus. Uh, it's a, essentially a revision of the previous one. They released it two days ago at the same price as the other one. So we'll uh, do a quick overview, new features and a comparison between this and the old one. Right, so the first thing you'll notice is that the layout is slightly different to before. It's the just about the same form factor, uh, but now we have these four USB ports instead of two. The RCA video and audio outputs have been replaced with a, a single four-pole stereo and composite video out. You've still got your HDMI. The GPIO pins have been extended from 26 to 40 and on this they've kept the first 26 of them the same so any projects that you may have had that you used the previous one for you can just plug straight into that the same way without having to worry about it. The standard SD card slot has been replaced with a micro SD port. They're now four mounting holes which makes it easier to install securely into cases. They have also improved the power supply. It uh, has a lower power consumption of 600 milliamp hours in comparison to 750 previously. The 5 volt 2 amp micro USB remains the same uh, but they've slightly changed where it is. It's now on this edge. Uh, and this one can supply 1.2 amps to the USB ports at the front. So you can plug your hard drive, everything, into that without having to have a powered power supply which uh, often made everything a bit messy before. So everything else, all the other hardware aspects remain virtually the same. They've still got their Broadcom BCM2835 chip which is at 700 megahertz. Uh, both have 512 megabytes of RAM and the same video core 4 graphics chip. So um, yeah, so overall um, I think the new layout makes it neater to fit on your desk. Uh, it's got a better efficiency, more USB ports. Uh, you don't need a powered hub anymore, which all oh, oh, this makes it easy to live with as a mini PC. Right, so that's uh, about everything. If you have any more questions, uh, Feel free to ask and I'll put a link to their website in the description so you can read it for yourself. So as always, thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe if you like the video.